here we are in uh, the Umatilla Basin off Highway 74 at one of the Oregon Department of Transportation gravel pits. Uh, so a lovely gravel pit. Oh yes. It's always nice. Very coarse. Missoula flood deposits. Uh, not a lot of silt. Coarse sand mostly and then gravels and, and boulders but uh, once in a while you get <clears throat> you get dikes so silt sand filled dike with all the usual characteristics probably six eight ten maybe maybe as many as ten fill bands this gravel pit uh, basically exposes an eddy bar. Humatilla Basin's wide and fairly flat. Not a lot of depth. Flood water is really spread out here. So even though a lot of coarse material is being moved, um, it's not the same as the Walla Walla Valley, which was a back flood uh, basin and a deeper ephemeral lake. So Humatilla Basin is kind of a weird place to find a lot of great outcrop. But where you do find things, you'll you'll always find dikes. So where you do have flood deposits, you have dikes. Here's a, an interesting <clears throat> plastic dike example. So coarse fill reflecting the nature of the local host sediment. So this fill material is what was available at the surface at the time floods came over. And so this material was rammed down and into these eddy bar sediments. So I don't know, that's, uh, this is 15 or so, 16 centimeters wide. There's 16, you know, roughly 30 centimeters. <laughs>